To connect a fast track remote switch to an SC2, it's pretty much the same process as the O and O27 switch, with one variation. On the underside of our fast track switch, we have a jumper installed between track power and auxiliary in. In order to run our switch machine on constant voltage, being that 14 volt fixed accessory voltage line that we talked about in the earlier videos, we want to get rid of this track jumper. So using a small flathead screwdriver, we're going to remove the jumper altogether. And we're going to install just a uh, spare piece of wire we have here into the auxiliary in terminal on the underside of the switch. Set that off to the side for a moment. We're now going to take the three wires from our SC2, starting with the gray wire, which is the common on the, uh, on the switch controller, and we're going to put that into the um, terminal labeled GND for ground. We're going to take the yellow wire, which is our straight route. Fortunately, on the fast track switch, it's labeled. So we're going to put that to our through position. And lastly is the green wire, which is our diverging route. We're going to put that to the out position. Okay, our switch is now wired, so what we're going to do is we're going to take our auxiliary in power connected to the red terminal on our accessory transformer, and we're going to take the black terminal connected to the outside rail, assuming all of your transformers are in phase, that out of the way, apply power, roughly about 14 volts. Our uh, LED for our switch lantern comes on. Using the remote, switch one, straight. Switch stays straight. Auxiliary two, or diverging route button. Switch machine throws to the out position. The aux one, or straight arrow key. Switch throws straight. Duplicate this wiring for your O gauge, O27, or fast track switches in the switch 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 position. And each one of your switches will be uh, controlled off the legacy remote or the TMCC1 cab 1. Um, let's go ahead and take some of the uh, competition's products and wire them up to the SC2 so we can show you how that's done. <laughs> 